Today in the chapter um, People not knowing how to ride the trains in Tokyo It is me and Carlos Asensio Also Glenn and Jamie over this direction um, So we don't know what we're doing And we're gonna get lost in the Tokyo underground train system Which is uh, fun Because what else would you do? I don't know, that's what we're doing We are now in Okanazahababa, Okanazahababa, something street where there's lots of guitar shops and we will look at uh, lots of guitar shops, Jamie? Yeah, yeah. Lots of guitar shops. Guitar. Yeah. We call it Lots of Guitar Road. We find something that's cool and has a cool color, and has strings on it. ESP shop is right there, we're gonna go there and there's lots of guitars everywhere. Yeah. Okay, start Jamie, Glenn, oh. Oh, look, Carlos is here too. Hello. Hello. We are now at Loud Planet, Tokyo. Um, tiny shop, but nice shit. Come on. <laughs> so we got, um, you know, the Ibanezes, the Jacksons. I mean, you know, this neat, but I have one. Thank you, Ibanez. And uh, oh, Talman and uh, Chavel. Oh, and a Bossy. That's the import line, but still nice. We have, of course, a guitar that you can touch like this, and then you get lots of clicks, like freaking Perfecto did. And, and check this out. This gentleman right there, where is he? Actually knows my channel. Fans in Japan. Thank you for watching. Oh, look, Carlos is here too. We got majesties. Oh, look at that blue majesty. The majesty of rock. This, I found something very special. Don't pay attention to having in the background there. He's no, no, but, 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 but look, 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 Glenn. Look, 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 look. This is a company from, I want to say, oh, Czech, Czech Republic. I met them at a guitar summit. They make fantastic guitars. Black hat guitars. And look at the back of this. Two seconds, I'm just trying to make sure you. Well, then make sure. Look at this. I just don't want to hear your voice. Yeah, my voice is beautiful. Let's get you the clicks. <laughs> oh, look at this. <laughs> That's a cool paint job. got a message for you so um, let, let's see what he's got to say so I don't know why you need to buy more amps than this one because this is everything your tube amps do but better and it's cheaper and easier to carry so
I just met, I, I met, met Matt. Matt has been met. Matt has been met. <laughs> At the uh, ESP something big store on that street that we're on. And um, if you see me laughing and pointing at extremely flamboyant ESP guitars at Nam, the way you get one of these is you come here. Ocha no Mizu. Ocha no Mizu. Of course. <laughs> Don't be dumb. Big Boss ESP. Big Boss ESP shop. Uh, shop. And then you um, talk to these nice people here. And they're gonna take your order and they're gonna point at Woods and then you're gonna say, nah, nah, ooh, huh? Yeah, maybe, mmm! So let, let me show you how that works. So you're gonna say, nah, mmm, oh, mm, uh, I don't know, oh, oh, that, yes, you're gonna say that. But then you're gonna go to mahogany because tone wood is a thing. And you're gonna say, Honduras mahogany, I don't know, maybe the mahogany. And then you're gonna, you know, see pricing. Oh, no, there's weight. Pricing is. Zero, we like that. Um, and you're gonna pick, whoa! You're gonna pick your tops, which are of course ridiculous, or redonkulous as they also say. And then you can pick your, I'm gonna say, neck wood. And look at these ridiculous woods. Of course, these are ESP custom shops. You know, you're gonna, you're gonna spend some money. Fretboard materials, we have Mad Madagascar rosewood, Indian rosewood, Indian, Indian, in Madagascar, Indian, Indian, Porfero, Indian, Porfero, and Indian. In the end, this is what then happens. Nice, nice shop, nice people. Nice people. Do you oh, like? That was a blast. Yeah, that was great. Oh, just... If guitars weren't nerdy enough, now we are in the nerdiest of the nerd places. Vintage video games. Then what are you looking for? I'm looking for old Intellivision games. Not having much luck though. Most of the stuff is like... You know... Because Intellivision requires intelligence, which there, I don't know. We are now walking from Ikebukuru, yeah, Ikebukuru, I don't know how to say that, Ikebu, Ik, Ikebukuru station to the hotel because I thought it would be cool and we're walking through residential neighborhoods. It is extremely safe because Jason said it and he's been living here for many years, we believe him. At any given point in time in Tokyo, he said people leave their phones on the table at McDonald's to reserve the table and then walk away and nobody takes the phones and we feel very safe. Yeah. He said and then probably someone jumps out somewhere. Hello, Eddie. It's a very strange feeling of being completely alone in the biggest city in the world. Of course, at any given point, you could get a hot tea if you wanted that, or a cold beverage, which is also kind of nice. In these really picturesque little streets, not what I expected in any way. Right, Carlos? Right. Right. Um, Hopefully we find the hotel and get some nippy nappy sleepy time because tomorrow we're leaving for Mount Fuji where I think the next morning we have an appointment at Yamaha to look at uh, Yamaha things. Yamaha things. Uh, Yamaha. We're going to find out how to say Yamaha. That's actually why we're going there. I'm going to walk in, ask how to say it and then walk out and that was my Yamaha trip. We'll find out. Night night. Yeah!